everybody welcome back to my channel so the video I have for you today if you notice by the title um, it's a pretty exciting one because it's probably the most requested video um, I've done so I've had requests for this on here on YouTube on Instagram Instagram live periscope like it's crazy. So I finally got the motivation to sit down and film this for you guys. So I'm pretty excited to show you guys my winged liner tutorial, um, or how I do my winged liner anyways. So if you want to see how I do it, then just keep watching and we'll get started. Bye. So first of all, I'm going to talk about the products that I use, uh, to wing my eyeliner out. And the one that I'll be using in this video is the Physician's Formula Eye Booster Pen. And that's what the packaging looks like. It has a two-in-one lash boosting eyeliner plus serum in it. Um, I ordered this on Amazon for like eight, like eight dollars and they actually sent me two. <laughs> so this is what the packaging looks like in case you guys are interested in purchasing it. Um, I have noticed that it has helped my lashes grow uh, a lot, so I really, really like this. Um, I heard about it from Andrea Mazzolano. I don't know if you guys watch her, but she swears by this, and she used to use the Stila Stay All Day um, liquid eyeliner, which is what I use, what I used to use <laughs> until I found this. Um, it is the exact same thing. It is a felt tip pen with a very precise point, and it has like a little shaker thing in there to help the eyeliner flow to the tip of the pen. Uh, I also use the e.l.f. Precision liquid liner. <laughs> liquid liner. This is the $2, no, this is the $3 version. Um, they have the $2 version, which is a little bit cheaper, I think, in quality. Um, this one's a little more precise and a lot like more opaque and black. Um, but this is just like your typical liquid liner and this one is actually a brush tip so you do have to be a bit more experienced <laughs> to use this. Uh, I have been wearing winged liner since I was 19 years old so about eight years and it takes a lot a lot of practice. Um, don't like I'll give you guys some tips like don't pull on your eye you just want to like rest your eye keep your eye open when you're trying to do it and yeah so enough of me blabbing I hope this video is helpful um, I hope it gives you some tips and I hope that you guys enjoy it because you have requested this video so so much and it's taken me forever to actually sit down and film it so we're gonna go ahead and get started so I'm gonna shake this up a little bit Oh, and by the way, my eye makeup was done by the, uh, I did it with the Too Faced Peach Palette. If you guys want to see a tutorial on this, thumbs up this video or let me know because I've had a few requests for that as well, but tutorials just take so much time. Okay, so I just have my little champagne pop with the mirror. Um, what I do is I just thinly line each of my eyes and then I go in and do the wing. So you guys are going to see me doing that. It's better to do too little than do too much because taking away eyeliner is a pain in the butt, especially this because it's waterproof and smudge proof, I think. Yeah, and it's 24 hour wear. The stuff is great.
I don't have a viewfinder on my camera, so hopefully like I'm I'm in the shot and in focus. So after I do that, that's what it looks like. And I'll just shake it up some more. And fix my face a little bit. My nose has a lot of dry skin on it right now. But yeah. Shake, shake, shake. And then I usually start with my left eye and then do my right eye. But to you guys, it's gonna be opposite. talking through this. Literally all I do is make a thin symmetrical line that um, matches up with the bottom of your like your bottom lash line. That's where you want your liner to start. You don't want to go too up high, you don't want to go too low. Um, you want it to be symmetrical with, or I guess parallel, no, no, symmetrical with um, your bottom lash line and then just draw the line and connect it with the top of your eyeliner that's on your eyelid already. And then if there's any like sparse areas, I'll just go in and just kind of darken them up. Um, this stuff is really good, um, but it can be a little bit not opaque, not too opaque. Um, so that's why, excuse me, that's why I do that. Okay, so that eye is done. I hope you guys can see well enough. And I'm just gonna shake this some more. I meant to put on lipstick before this video, but I didn't. Okay, and then I'm gonna do the same exact thing on this eye. This is usually the, the eye that I mess up on. <laughs> I don't know why. I can always do this eye better than this eye, but if you guys wear a wing liner, I'm pretty sure you know how it goes. Okay. done. Um, I know I kind of make it look a little easy, but honestly, if you get a pen like this, it's pretty foolproof. Um, you're basically just drawing on your eye with permanent, a thin permanent marker. So that is my finished winged eyeliner. Um, I am going to do my mascara and spritz my face with some makeup setting spray. And yeah, that is pretty much that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you do subscribe, be sure to hit the little uh, bell button next to the subscribe button to be notified when I upload every video because I know you guys just can't get enough of me. <laughs>
totally kidding. Um, but yeah, I will talk to you all later. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.